what's up? Welcome back to my channel. We are talking all about my braids today and how I've been maintaining them over the past week or so. I got these done a week from today, as you guys are seeing this video. I'm first going in with this Marc Anthony dry shampoo foam to use as my cleanser. Now you guys, there's a lot of ways to maintain your braids, but I like to cleanse my hair or at least my scalp as much as possible. So I'm using this as a way to do that. And I really like this foam because you don't have to wait for it to dry or anything before you continue to set or reset the style. So I'm just adding this all over. Honestly, I use a ton of it. You probably don't need to use this much, but I do. I just find it, it's easy to just like get in there and just start massaging it in, making sure that it's reaching those areas that may have been just like not receiving much love because my hair is obviously in this protective style. So I'm just working it through my scalp in all the different areas, especially obviously in my parts um, where my edges and my my um, just hair may get itchy or scratchy so this helps with that gives you like a cooling effect so I'm just doing that all the way around then I'm adding this Jamaican black castor oil just to moisturize my scalp and give it some life and treatment I know that Jamaican black castor oil is super popular and it's a great way to promote growth of your hair and do a lot of great things and so I like to do this prior to using this Mizani foam so this is gonna actually set my style again. This is gonna lay down all those little frizzy hairs that I have and I'm doing this all the way down my braids too because I do have some hair left out in certain areas of my braids so those areas get a little bit frizzy too but I'm just adding the foam onto there and then I'm going to wrap it up into a bun so that it sets itself while the rest of my hair that's actually cornrowed is also setting. And once my hair is all tied up, I'm going to go ahead and wrap my hair with this silk scarf. I like to use bigger silk scarves than this one, honestly, because it doesn't cover all of my hair enough, but it's the one I have on hand, so I'm actually gonna use this headband as a way to secure it even more and to cover the little areas, like in the front, as you see there, um, and in the back, that may not have been covered with the silk scarf. But Majority of it's covered with a silk scarf, so you should be fine with just that if that's all you have. So now my hair has set for about an hour and a half, two hours. You can do this overnight, but I did it in the same day. So as you can see, my hair looks super fresh and all those little baby hairs that even some of which that you couldn't see on camera were laid down. And my hair just feels very refreshed and like cool, you know what I'm saying? Like it feels like it's been rejuvenated. So yeah, that's it. That is how I maintain my braids. I'm also gonna show you guys how I slay my edges girl this isn't really a part of the tutorial but it's just how I style my baby hair and whatnot in the front I love using got to be gel I've been sleep on it it's the best gel out there for laying your edges and having them stay all day the weave girls y'all weave queens y'all know about this gel I'm new to the game so yeah that is all I have for you guys hope you enjoyed this video short sweet and simple on how to maintain and keep your braids fresh. Until my next video, you guys, I will see you in the next one. Bye.